Hey guys, it's Demander1957. Welcome back to 7 Days to Die. It's currently the morning of day 3, and we're upstairs in the firehouse loft just waiting for morning to come. Hear a horde running by. I don't know if you guys can hear that or not. That's kind of a butt clincher. Because there's absolutely no reason why they should hear me. I'm hidden, crouched, not moving, etc. Well, anyway, assuming they don't bust up in here and eat my brains, first thing on today's agenda is we're going to grab the auger get some iron going in Joel's forge so we can make repair kits to keep everything up and running get, grab some gasoline out of these cars that are right out front and look for stumps so we can get some honey get some antibiotics going before we die of an infection all right There's Lois walking away over there, last straggler, I guess. Anyway, let's uh, wrench these cars up, get some gas. What was that? I could have sw swore I heard somebody close by. Oh, it's old crawler boy. All right, I guess we'll take care of his silly ass. Yeah. Oh, nice. How did I miss that? No, Darlene. Uh, I hear multiple bogeys coming. Sure do. Well now. Hmm. All right. Daisy, you're first. Try to maintain some situational awareness here. Okay, big boy. Hey ho, hey ho, hey ho. Lois. Make me use up all my blunderbuss ammo now. Glad I found that 762 ammo, but I don't want to waste all of it. You all feel sprightly first thing in the morning, Brittany. All of y'all need to piss off. Let's uh, finish what we was doing. Wrench that car up and get on with our day. Mm. 
Man, that infection rate goes up so damn quick. Yeah, Lois. All right. Let's see what's hanging around first, because it's probably going to draw everything. Oh, wait a minute. I bought this last night just to use. Okay. Yeah, I knew that'd get some attention. That's all right. What are you doing over there, you dummy? Aw, oh, gee, you can't hit me through Joel's defenses. Sucks to be you. Alright, now I forget. What else did he have? Yeah, destroyed workbench, destroyed ceiling. So all he's got is... Uh, the forge, which I mean, I guess that's better than nothing. And before I do that, I forget how much forged iron costs. We better see about that first. We don't need a whole lot of it, but we do need some. Okay, oh, it's 12 iron per. Why does it only say one? Did I not put that in there? Like a dummy? There we go. Now it's starting to work. Alright, yeah, that'll be plenty. So we'll make the rest of this into turret ammo and sell it to Joel here. Get a few more bucks in our pocket. Well, we got plenty of food, etc. right now while that ammo is crafting and those uh, iron is smelting down we're going to walk around and see if we can find a stump like that one right there come on RNG Jesus give me some honey Ugh. All right, well, here's this little place again. I guess we can hit this. Maybe we'll get lucky and find some antibiotics. Try to be real sneaky like and get this other one. Ooh, right there, too. Just like that. Okay, medicine. Come on. No, I mean, that's good stuff, but not what I'm needing. Shotgun shells. Okay, more ammo and stuff. Well, polymer string mod, that might actually work on this bow. Let's check that out. Yep, sure does. Now it's not quite as crappy. We most definitely are not messing with the Fates Motel, that's for damn sure. Well, come here, Bruce.
Well, we're getting plenty of ammo. Too bad it's not what we're needing right now. Now, when I'm not infected, I find stumps with honey in them just all the time, just literally underfoot. Hmm, there's some town down that way. We may have to head down there, see if we can find a popping pills or something. Let's see what it takes to make herbal antibiotics. No, of course, it's locked behind a recipe. Okay, what all do I got on me? Yeah, some decent stuff. I guess we'll go back over to Joel's, get that iron rolling. And much as I hate it, we'll... I'm not sure. We wander off into the wilderness trying to find stumps take our chances with that working out or we could try going downtown over there see if we can find a pharmacy or a popping pills I'm not loving either option really okay how much can we make 30 of them that's plenty let's sell Joel this other crap Speak with me, friend. Joel, you need to stock some antibiotics, my man. We'll sell him all these shotgun shells. I don't need them. Definitely don't need that sludge steel hammer. Um, I guess I'll keep that and wear it. I'll sell him half of this 9 mil ammo, because who knows when we're going to find a pistol. Beer is not medicine, dude. Okay, you don't even want the bone knife. You come back sometime. Alright, that can do its thing. I'm going to head back to the house, drop whatever I don't need on me off, and then we'll go looking for stumps, I guess. The least risk. I only got one shot left in the blunderbuss, so that's kind of a waste to be carrying that around. I don't anticipate needing a wrench either. There are a lot of damn zombies wandering around. We're going to quietly sneak over here to these gun safes and use this rock or uh, jailbreakers. See about getting into them. Alright, hell with y'all. Oh, nice. We got some good stuff there. Got another blunderbuss, ammo for it, and a marksman's rifle. Hey. Now that's the way it should be. You get into a locked gun safe, and guess what? You should stand a chance of finding a gun in it. I 
Who else is beating on my damn house? Opie? Piss off! Alright, where did that thing go? Sniper rifle. I'll put the bow away for right now. Lay your ass down, boy. Oh, we got a silencer mod? Well, let's see if that'll work on that. Well, of course it will. Okay, we can put the hunting rifle away. We'll take that robotic sludge with us. I've always said that thing was useless, but it definitely beats punching on them with my bare fist. Oh, let me repair these blunderbusses that we now have real quick. And then we'll go searching for stuff before I die. Alright, now that we actually got a little bit of firepower. Um, you know what? Let's take care of this dog. It's right next door. I don't like that. Hey, I'm crouched. You don't see me, right? The hell. Oh. <laughs> That's what you get. Hello, hello. All right, you want out? Come on, Steve. Crikey, it's the Irwins. Uh, of course, it was open. Let's clear the rest of this place. Wow. Real sound sleeper, ain't you? Desert Vulture Schematic. Mmm, yes. Oh, look what I found. Jar of honey. Well, it's not going to cure us, but it'll definitely help. Yeah, yeah, whatever. What's up, Opie? See Bruce just materialize out of nowhere there in that corner. Ain't that something? Hmm. 
Fish tacos. Where's Jen when I need her? Light him up. Damn, man, I'm burning through my newfound blunderbuss ammo real quick, like, though. Let's leave these fuckers a supply, a surprise. Got lots of bogeys incoming. In fact, we got a whole wandering horde. Okay, we got a fight on our hands coming up. I think we should wait for them. Y'all can suck it. Now, let's continue on our merry way here. You know what, Buck? It's a damn good thing for you. I don't bother passive creatures. Otherwise, your ass would have been grass. Got the bear den there and the other pawn shop. I don't remember ever finding uh, medicine up in that. Call finding medicine up here in this old really auto. So I guess we can live on the edge and try to get in here and find some. I don't even remember how you're supposed to get in here. Okay, that don't look like a door to me. Oh, the wall's all glitching out. Got a feeling I better leave that the hell alone. We'll just keep an eye out for some stumps since we're already out in the wilderness again. We'll keep that rifle close to Punchy McPunchy face just so we can throw down if we need to. Well, there's a Shamway Foods, definitely not what I'm looking for. And a jar of honey, bingo. We just might make it yet. All right, that gives us a little bit of breathing room on finding the next stump anyway. Joe also restocks tomorrow. All 
All right, there's another stump. Come on, let's get lucky. Nope. See Biker Bob over there. Well, I didn't hit him, but he didn't hear us either. There, I hit him. There, get a taste of Punchy McPunchy Face. No luck on finding more antibiotics or honey yet. So I guess we better head our butt home before it gets full on dark. Yeah, big mama, I see ya. Hmm, question is going to be, can I get there before nightfall officially comes? I guess I can fight my way the last few yards. <laughs> Pushing it pretty close. We'll check the vending machines because I... Seem to remember sometimes they might have honey. Well, don't look like it right now, though. guys guess I'm gonna put stuff away hide out for the rest of the night see how much further down my infections going yeah it's only got 0.4 percent that gives us enough breathing room we can wander around some more tomorrow and try to find some kind of antibiotics or more honey anyway hope you enjoyed the content I really appreciate you watching and I'll catch you tomorrow in the next one talk to you later Bye.